share the fun with a quick knitting project that'll help others in need. I've been having so much fun knitting soap sacks. These fast and easy projects were just what I needed to jumpstart my enthusiasm for knitting again. Soap sacks can be used to collect small slivers of soap or to corral a bar of soap, making it easier to hold and to use. These sacks are welcomed by many charitable groups around the world who provide hygiene supplies for the needy. Using 100% cotton yarn, I dusted off and oiled my bulky machine and I got creative. Instead of just thinking about knitting, I cast on and I started to play. Of course, I started with a couple of swatches. Washing and drying one gave me an accurate finished gauge so I would know exactly what size my sacks would end up and make sure that they were the recommended size of six inches by four inches after they got wet. I wanted minimal finishing, so I decided to knit from the top down. I used a pretty Pico cast on and added some easy eyelets for a drawstring. Then knit the sack and decreased and gathered up the bottom so I didn't even have to bind off. One little four inch seam, a crochet drawstring and voila! It was so satisfying to quickly start and finish a sack in no time. Of course, once I got started, my mind started adding different techniques like a bit of reverse stockinette, stripes, and my favorite, the garter and eyelid version. I didn't get too carried away with stitch patterns and color, but I'll bet you'll be able to create some beautiful and useful soap sacks for charity, gifts, or bizarre items to sell. If you'd like an excuse to get knitting, grab some 100% cotton yarn, use the free Knit It Now pattern so you don't have to do any math, and get knitting. If you'd like to get involved with the group who's helping provide these soap sacks for the needy, please visit soapsacks.com. To learn more about how Knit It Now can help you create soap sacks on your machine, visit knititnow.com soap sacks for our quick win. I hope you have as much fun with the soap sacks as I've had, and happy knitting!